Hey guys, it's Norm at the Gamer here. I'm about to do a legendary unboxing. It's probably just gonna be a normal unboxing, but this game is a game I've been waiting for for a really long time. Well, kinda. The reason why I bought my 3DS, and yeah, so I'm gonna have my friend here hold the camera while I unbox it. So, yep, went to GameStop. I already had it paid off and everything. But here it is Kingdom Hearts 3D Dream Drop Distance. It's only for the 3DS, but this game is basically gonna be my game of the year. So, let's go ahead and get the packaging off. As you, uh, as you guys know, it talked about how it has a uh, limited edition AR cards included. So, honestly, I don't care about the uh, AR system with Vita and uh, 3DS because it's just not that cool anymore. It's sudden cool to showcase, but what this type of game is like, do I even care? I just want, you know, Kingdom, classic Kingdom Hearts, the story, character, you know, everything that makes Kingdom Hearts. I don't care about AR technology. Unless they make it cool. But anyway, getting off, a little off topic there. Kingdom Hearts 3D, there is the bots art. Like I said, it's only for the 3DS. It also talks about how it's Kingdom Hearts 10 year anniversary. So, yeah. Um, let's go ahead and get to the back. It talks about darkness becomes light. Light falls into darkness. I'm not going to read that little summary, but you guys see it right there. And then we have pictures. It talks about a brand new adventure filled with favorite Disney characters. Master motion flow to um, execute acrobatic movements and attacks and then join forces with dream eaters to punish enemies and then uh, this guy here his name's Niku and he's from another Square Enix title uh, called The World Ends With You and I thought that was pretty cool they brought those type of characters to this game but down here it talks about how it's two player co-op and what I think they're talking about is probably AR I figured they'll probably have AR battles kind of like Yu-Gi-Oh I guess you could say I don't know if that's the case but uh as far as pl uh, two players goes, I think that's how it works, but I'll let you guys know if I find out something else. It talks about it has, street, it has street, uh, street Pass. Don't know how that works. I'm guessing something with the Dream Meters, but like I said, I'll let you guys know if I notice something pretty cool. And then it also has Circle Pad Pro Support, which is this little thing right here. Um, it adds a second analog stick um, control and also triggers on the top. Honestly, I was used to the um, normal Kingdom Hearts 3D controls with, um, you know, from the demo, but I, I'm going to try this out and hopefully it doesn't mess anything up for me. Hopefully it feels better. Um, hopefully it feels the best as far as, you know, using Circle Pad Pro because I remember with Kid Icarus Uprising as Circle Pad Pro support and it was only used for left-handed people. I mean, I'm like, what the crap? So that was kind of a waste for me to buy, but... It, it works, man. Let's go ahead and get this baby open. And here are those exclusive AR cards. I'll get those unpackaged in a minute. I don't care about this thing. You guys probably saw the code. Same with this one. Oh my gosh, why do they always include codes and stuff? But if you guys want those codes, well, you guys probably already saw it. I'm not going to use it. I promise you guys that. But here's the manual. Colorful. Kind of bulky. Not going to go page by page, but you guys get the point. Then the inside is pretty cool. We have different dream meters inside the holes and stuff. I mean, I'm not about the dream meters about the, uh, in this game, but it'll, it'll work. It'll work. It's pretty cool. And then we have the cartridge right here, Kingdom Hearts 3D Dream Drop Distance. Yes, I will be playing this game for a while, but that's pretty much it. Um, let's go ahead and get the um, AR cards open. Get, uh, you guys get a good look of it. And hopefully... I don't, well, I don't know. It's just, I really hope I don't get into this AR card system. Maybe it's something really cool. I'm just not, you know, I'm just denying that it's going to be cool. I hope I don't get into it because I had opportunities where I could have got more AR cards. I can't get these cards out. There we go. All right, so we got this one here. All right, that Dream Eater looks pretty cool. Has a little mohawk and headphones and stuff. And I see his little um, get up there. Looks like a hoodie. I think that's pretty cool. The other ones just look, yeah. <laughs> Then we have the Dream Eater sign. And then this one's just random. <laughs> it reminds me of like a Pokemon or something. But I guess that works. I'll, I'll see how the AR card system works out. But as far as I know, it's just not going to be my type of thing. But I'm going to go ahead and get Kingdom Hearts in the 3DS. Uh, I had nothing else in there because I was preparing for this day. Come on, Kingdom Hearts, go ahead and pop up for me. Oh, well, that's an epic fail. Let's try that again. There we go. And you guys probably can't see this 3D effect. 
But yeah, but I'm gonna leave it at uh, at that for this unboxing. If I am gonna be doing an LP, the first LP episode will be posted on this channel, my main channel, Normac the Gamer, and all the other episodes of the Kingdom Hearts 3D LP would be posted on my second channel, Normac X Gaming. I'll try to leave the link down below in the in the description to that channel so you guys can go watch that, subscribe to it. That's where I post all my um, gaming videos that are over 15 minutes long because unfortunately I can't post over 15 minutes on my main channel here. But uh, yeah, it's going to be pretty awesome. I have uh, a setup here. Uh, I actually have this thing called auxiliary cord. Stuff falling. And what this will allow me to do is I'll plug this up to my 3DS right here. And it will record all game audio with the sound recorder I have. And then with this, I'll plug in my Turtle Beach so I can hear the game. And it will be recording at the same time. And I'll be recording with my iPhone camera that is HD. Um, and I can talk, uh, commentate. So everything will work out. And I'll try to get them out as soon as possible. I wanna, I don't want to beat the game so fast. But in order to do an LP, you know, LP for a game like this, you know, I'm just psyched that I'll be able to do one for a game. That, I'll lo that I love and you know it's a new game so I think it'll, everything will definitely work out but I think that's all for this unboxing hope you guys enjoyed Kingdom Hearts 3D 3DS and I'm gonna go ahead and get on the Circle Pad Pro now hopefully everything works out with that and I'm hoping it is um, dual analog controls but we'll see how that works but uh, make sure to look out for that LP uh, the first episode should be coming out really soon the other episodes should follow um, after that. Um, probably not too quick just because of I'll make the videos a little longer, which will take more uh, gigabytes, um, you know, space uh, to record. And then, you know, how that goes. It just takes a while to get everything going. But I will get everything out. But that is all. Hope you guys enjoy. Make sure to comment your thoughts on this unboxing. Rate if you like the video or not. And subscribe for more content on me on this channel or my other channel. I'll leave the uh, second channel of Normacats Gaming down below in the description, the link for that. So, yep, that's it. Hope you guys enjoy, and I'll chat with you guys later. See ya.